Yo, what's going on? Look into the Soul Day Entertainment TV, and this is my third time recording this because I speak way too much, and I don't want the intro to be fucking 10 minutes long because that's literally how long it was every single time. I don't know why I speak so much, but it's really starting to hinder me. Um, basically, what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be doing armor testing. I have all the basic armor that anybody can get normally, um, other than like the dust reactor, because obviously if you're not 220, you won't be getting that, or the Vengeance Guard, you won't be getting that unless you spend a stupid amount of money on the game, um, or you're really good at... Uh, marketplace selling stuff i can't remember what they're called at the moment um so i have anywhere from the sports armor all the way up to the vengeance card i didn't you, you'll have to shoot me because i cheaped out you know i didn't get the 300 million dollar scarab reactive um if anybody wants to send me a scarab reactive or the 50 million dollar titan armor or whatever uh feel free and i will break it over and over and over again for these things uh, i wanted to basically chronolog the information on these armors and basically uh the certain things that i want to test with them uh mainly being obviously the armor the durabilities and the absorption for the armors i have it right here uh the reason why this takes so long at the beginning is because i'm explaining all of this stuff um so i'm just gonna leave that out of this part uh shout out to anybody who even makes it to the end of this video <laughs> Uh, today we're going to be doing the dog zombie just because I'm going in chronological order with what they have over here at the bestiary. I will be going through all of these zombies, obviously not in this video, but in subsequent videos. We're going to focus on one zombie per video, and then it's going to be the armors that are doing most of the work. Um, obviously all of those armors there. Uh, so these are their durabilities on the left, following these, this colon here. And then the percentages on the right. I'm sure you guys know how armor durability and absorption percentages work. Um, this is the expected armor survival time, ass assuming an average attack rate of one attack every one and a quarter seconds. I tested a bunch of different zombies, spitters, rumblers, brutes, tendrils, spiders, everything. I tested them and I had a little stopwatch with me and I hit the stopwatch. Once they hit me, I hit the stopwatch and then I let them hit me again just so that way I could account for the time it takes for them to get up to me. As soon as they hit me, I started the stopwatch once they hit me again. That's when I stopped it and every single time it stopped on one of the quarter. Maybe that's just my finger. Maybe that's just happenstance. But as far as I'm concerned, it's one and a quarter seconds uh, for one attack. This is going to be the accuracy based on my opinion. Obviously, if you want to uh, pause that and look at these. Uh, this is the accuracy based on my opinion. So sports armor says 12 and a half seconds. Let's say I get 13 seconds. Maybe I'll put it at 95% accurate or even 100% accurate because I might account for the half a second it takes for that dog to get up to me to, to even start doing damage. Um, and then this is the health left over after breaking because obviously even though the vengeance card might take longer to break, that's a 95% absorption. So we might have more health. Yeah. We'll see. Um, I think that that is a decent enough explanation. These will have to fill out along the way. I will pause the video and fill them out myself and then show you the full breakdown at the end of the video so you won't have to worry about seeing me uh, do all of these here. Um, so this is, uh, it does 10 melee damage and this is its disturbed, enraged, and uh, calm speed spawns in any zone. Um, so yeah, with all that being said, uh, so that way this doesn't drag out for another 15 minutes. Shout out to anybody who makes it to the end of the video. Um, yeah, let's see. Let's see if these are accurate. Let's see how long we can last with our, uh, with our armors. Okay, so here's my buddy right here. Um, I currently have the sports armor on. Um, I am not going to hit him. <laughs> Do not hit him. Uh, so what I'm going to do, basically, is I'm going to allow him to get as close to me as possible and then start the stopwatch, just trying to give it a fair shake. Um, and then we will count the health we have at the end of the armor breaking and how long it takes for that armor to break. So let's see what we have here. Okay. I have the timer going. Uh, he's, he's, he's munching on that ass, boy. I'm not going to move because I don't want to disrupt what he's got going on right now. But he is munching real good. Okay. All right. So that's that's time right there. We're gonna we're gonna go into the inventory, uh, so that way I can heal up and put on another armor. All right. So just so y'all know, the time I got was thirteen point zero six seconds. So that's that's pretty accurate. I'm not gonna do that for every single one. Um, obviously, I'm not gonna lie to you guys about what time I got. I'm just gonna tell you like it is. Uh, but thirteen point zero six seconds. I'm gonna go put that down. I'm gonna put down the accuracy, and we'll be back. 
Okay, so we are back with the Xylon Vest now. Obviously, a little bit more durability and a little bit more damage absorption. However, we will see if we wind up with the same amount of health or if it takes a little bit longer than we expected. Obviously, I have to stopwatch reset. I'm going to let him get as close to him as possible. I'm going to start the stopwatch. Um, yeah, let's, let's get right into it. We might as well not fuck around. Stopwatch is started, guys. Um, this is gonna take a minute, so I hope y'all brought y'all's, uh, y'all's popcorn or anything. Oof. I don't even think I'll be able to finish. Oh, he missed! He missed! He missed! We gotta account for that miss. We have to account for that miss. I'm gonna die. Okay, that's that. I died. All right, give me one second. I'll be right back. Okay, so that didn't go so hot. I mean, so let's be honest. The, the, the sports armor seems to be better than the Xylon vest in terms of survivability and, and, and durability. I mean, it, you're gonna at least you're gonna break your sports armor before you die. Uh, maybe that's a good thing. Maybe it's not. Who knows? Um, so now we're gonna do with the Xylon vest. I did try to account for the time, and I did add an extra thing to the little notepad there i did a i don't want this lady coming over causing problems at any point in time um i did add a like actual time it took to die on top of the um is there anybody else coming along no on top of like the expected time to die i tried to account for the other one i don't know if it worked that much um i took a couple seconds off just because it looked like it took some time to reset so we are going to go on and we're gonna let this happen well, hold on. I don't want to be facing that way. I'm going to let this happen. Wow. Could you stop missing, bro, and just do your job? Damn, bro. You suck. We're going to have to account for that those misses now. Okay, it looks like we're going to balance out here. Maybe be at 5% health left. Maybe. Oh. You missed again, bro. Don't miss. Stop missing. Don't miss. Okay, that's it. We are broken. All right, I'm gonna open my inventory and I'm going to go fill out the sheet. I'm gonna, I'm gonna heal up. And be right back. Okay, I have tallied everything up. We are back with the flak jacket. We are healthy, perfectly healthy, and everything like that. Um, hopefully, he doesn't miss this fucking time. Um, I actually, I actually didn't, uh, account for the misses on that one. I'm gonna have to probably reduce it by at least four and a half seconds, because, I mean, it took him, he missed three or four shots at a, at a second and a quarter apiece. Yeah, it's like four and a half seconds, so, uh, I'm gonna, at this point, I'm not just gonna put the keyboard down, I'm gonna try to align myself with his jaws, because he apparently sucks donkey's cock and can't hit me, so, again, we're gonna, we're gonna start this up, we're gonna let him get as close as possible, and then start the timer. Okay. Now, I'm going to try and keep myself in his mandibles so he doesn't miss, but I don't know how well that's going to work. Uh, he seems to be doing an okay job so far. Okay. I did not account for this. I did not account for the fact that uh, I might die before my armor. I did not account for this fact. Okay. Okay. I'm going to I'm going to stop it right there. Huh. Uh let me see what I'm going to do about this. Okay, so I honestly did not account for the fact that you might Oh, you bitch. No, no, I have to find a new doggy. Uh I honestly did not account for the fact that you might honestly die before the uh before the armor breaks. Um I figured, like, you might die as the armor is breaking, uh, but I did not account for the fact that you would die before the uh, the armor breaks. So I just added a little section. Uh, I'll actually, I'll show you guys real quick. Uh, let me, no, I'll show you after we're done with, with this with this test here with the mess SLX. Uh, and by the way, if anybody wants to fatten up my bank account, um, I single-handedly am keeping the armor repair guys and the health medics guys uh, in business um, right now. 
So obviously I have the stopwatch. We have the next armor on. We're going up in sequence. Uh, and hopefully, <laughs> hopefully I don't fucking die before, um, before the armor breaks. But you know, we're learning stuff here, guys. We are learning stuff here. So I'm going to let him kill that bitch. I'm gonna let him get as close as possible. I preferably on the downward angle. Uh, and we will start the stopwatch. Okay, we are in. We are in. It doesn't look like I'm gonna die before the armor, which is good. Okay. We're at a, about a 10% difference here, going up about another one percentage point every hit, it looks like, roughly. Hit, hit and a half. Um, let's see what we get here. Okay, and we are broken. All right, that is going to be an inventory, and we will count our percentages and the armor broken. Okay, we are back. Um, I didn't have any more meds on me. I, I had to go get, uh, excuse me, I had to go get more meds. So, as long as there's no other zombies that decide they want to run towards me. Obviously, we are doing the Mesh RX-2 now, I believe it is. Um, last one went pretty well. I didn't die before my armor fucking broke. So, let's go ahead and let him get close. Start the timer. And uh, let's get it going. Okay, timer is started. Yeah, keep on hitting me. Yeah, do me dirty. Just real dirty. Oh, this one's close. Oof, this one's close. How'd you miss? Stop missing. Do better. I can't wait till we get into the other zombies and hopefully they won't be as fucking shit as you, kid. Okay? Because you're trash. You're fucking trash. Okay. Yeah, do the thing. Yeah, munch right on my sack, brother. Just give it to me real good. Let me have it. Spit on me. Spit my mouth. Okay, that is a stop right there. We're going to inventory it. 6% health. That's a woof. That is a woof. Okay, I'm gonna add all that in. We'll be right back. I'm just gonna put this in right here for anybody who sees this and watches all the way to the end. I know y'all are gonna fucking make fun of me for not being able to do math or whatever, or knowing in my head uh, what this shit is. I'm just saying this isn't my fault. I'm writing down everything that Neil has. So down here, when I put that 10 out of 160 is 6%, I'm not an idiot, okay? That's just what, that's just what he, it's just what he put. I mean, it's it's close enough, but I mean, technically, like, sixteen would be ten percent. But okay, whatever. I mean, you can only get so close in horseshoes and hand grenades, right? Okay. Let's see. We are with, back with the SN forty two armor. Um, I wrote down all of the die, bitch. I wrote down a whole of the. She looked like she was coming for me, so she had to die. I wrote down all the information in that thing. Um, oh, I hate that the fucking melee is at AOE now, because I'm always afraid I'm going to kill him after that. So let's get them all set up, and then we will start taking the ash chopping, and uh, we will start the timer. Let's go. All right. So again, it's looking like we are not going to die before this armor quits out on us. Um. Now, I'm going to put it to you this way, guys. The Because this dog likes to run a lot, uh, the discrepancy in timing, not to mention the misses, um, it's going to be about five seconds every single time. That's just what I'm seeing. Uh, and I do think that that is the dog's fault, not, not the game's fault or the armor's fault or anything like that. So that's a stop on the timer. Um, we are at 60 and 37%. Uh, and broken so let's add that to the thing be right back okay we are all right we are going okay so we are back with it exterminator mesh um i wrote down everything for the other one obviously uh honestly i don't even know what to say let's just get right the fuck let's just get right into it let me get close start up the timer okay there we go timer has started He's a little less runny now, uh, now that he's not enraged, but, uh, he apparently still sucks at hitting. Um, he's already missed one time. 
you know, story of my life, sometimes you miss the box, brother. Sometimes you miss the box. Uh, we all try to hit the box when we're young, uh, get it out of the way. But, you know, sometimes we just miss. Sometimes we just fuck it up. So, can't really blame them too much. Um, it looks like we are down a little bit more since uh, the last time, or the last one that we had. That's going to be a stop right there. Uh, and we are going to pause up, open up our inventory, heal up, armor up, write everything down. We'll be right back. Okay. Okay, and we're back. Sorry, I didn't count the seconds on the last one. Let me just make sure everything is okay. Okay. Hey, come here. Uh, we are back with the, I honestly can't even remember which one this is, Reactive XT800, something like that. Y'all know what it is. Y'all know the armor's better than me. I'm just trash. So let's get this started. Okay, we are going. And I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this out there right now. Uh, like I said earlier, I am seeing a definitive, roughly five second discrepancy just based off of misses or him taking the time to run or walk or whatever the case may be. Um, I sure hope he doesn't, there's a fucking miss. I sure hope he doesn't push me out here because uh, I might have to wind up turning if he's going to. Doesn't look like it. Okay, that's a stop right there and we are going to open the inventory. Obviously you guys know the drill. We will be right back. Okay, and we are back with the Exterminator Mesh GT. That wasn't, that was the Reactive SLX, the last one. Uh, this is the GT. We're gonna go ahead and reset the clock and we are going to start it right now. Okay. So I think in the last one, the discrepancy was about six seconds, roughly. Um, well, you know, we'll account that extra second to, you know, who knows fucking what. Another fucking miss, two misses. Fucking hell, brother, hit the box. I'm trying to make this as accurate as possible for the people and you're not even hitting me in my box. Fucking dogs, man. You know, you, you think putting some peanut butter on the box and letting them just go to town, you think they'd fucking, they, they know what to do, but they don't. Loser ass fucking dogs. Trying to like stay as still as possible for them too. Oops, and that, that's a, uh, okay, cool. Cool, thank God I stopped, I stopped it right when he was supposed to bite me, so. That's about as close as that's going to be. Um, damn, only 12% left uh, on that right there. We will be right back. All right, so now we have the Reactive XT 800. Um, I tried to account for as much as possible the misses in the last one, as well as the, uh, the I think I, I started the timer a little early, but again, it's still it was still roughly a five uh, second discrepancy. So let's go ahead and allow him to, maybe I'll have him push me like this way and I'll go ahead and start the timer now. Okay. It's going well so far. Uh, I didn't know how much money I was gonna spend doing this, but I'm gonna spend apparently a lot of fucking money because healing is expensive, y'all. So <laughs> that fucking blows, but okay. Hit your, hit your target, hit your target. So that way we can, uh, we can be accurate. I'm having fun, though. I really am. It's, I'm having fun figuring out this stuff, doing all this information. Uh, maybe we'll get similar testing in the, in the next videos, but uh, we will see. And that is a stop right there. Um, it actually took less... Sorry, it took less time for this one here. I fucking hit the pause button for some reason. I'm gonna go ahead and go to my inventory. Uh, heal on back up. I actually don't know if I have any heals, but we will be back whenever I'm healed up and have a full armor. Okay, shout out to anybody who has made it this far into the video. I know it's probably boring per se, uh, because it's just me getting smacked around a bunch. But uh, hopefully you guys are appreciating, you know, and having fun with me, you know, like the stuff, what it, the, not what it takes to do this, because obviously I'm just fucking getting smacked around, but like, appreciating like this this information getting out there and it being um instead of just being an estimate i'm actually going out like getting hit and doing this and doing that so let's go ahead and reset our timer here boys we're here with the nomad mesh now uh so i'm going to without further the fuck ado because this video is honestly going to be long enough wait for him to get up to me strike and the timer has started okay we are not going to die before this armor breaks it looks like I wonder if during the longevity of 
this series if like the only armor we're going to die with is the Zylon vest or if we're going to die with another armor and it's going to be those two armors consistently because they're such terrible armors we're exposing Zylon vests here guys if if you want to die before uh, your armor breaks, go with the Xylon Vest, honestly, because the Xylon Vest fucking sucks. Okay, why you gotta, why you gotta, why you gotta fucking, alright, I am going to stop the timer right there, because this bitch has to come the fuck in, and now I gotta smoke her ass. Ah, I killed my fucking dog. God damn it, you bitch. Hold on, I'm not giving up on this. I am not giving up on this. No, don't fucking hit me. Just take this ass beating. I forgot how slow this thing swings. Okay, I'm starting the timer back up. Started. And stopped. Fucking yeah, no. hell. Okay, we're gonna go into our inventory here. Uh, 40%. It looks like, or 25%, 40 out of 160. It looks like that's pretty common for, for most of these, so... Uh, we're going to add this to the notepad. We're going to heal up. We're going to be right back. All right, and we're back with the... We're fully healed. We have the exterminator reactive now. Um, there was a couple of misses last time, and then obviously that person came along. So, unfortunately, that won't be as... Act Hello? What the fuck? Are y'all good, though? Y'all really want this smoke, huh? Why don't you... Why don't you... Get fuck? What?! What? Oh my god, now I have to find another dog. Mm. Alright, I'll be right back. Alright, now we are back with the exterminator reactive and my doggy dog. Because those bitches took my other ones. Made me smoke them. Uh, oh my god. Fuck. Out of here. Alright, let's get this started. Hurry. Alright, I have started. Whew. Thank God. I meant to get a drink before I did this one, but of course I didn't because I'm dumb. Uh, we might actually stay above 50% for this one. We'll see. Uh, because it's looking like we were at 90 or 90% 90 health and 80% armor, I thought. Something like that. So we only lost like 10% health. Yeah, we might actually stay above 50%. Wow, this is a good arm. This is a good armor to skip to. Evidently. Okay, and that's that's it. We're going to inventory right there. Uh, I'm going to stop the timer. I'm going to take about two seconds off because I can stop the timer because I'm fucking dumb. Uh, we're going to heal up. We're going to write everything down. And we're going to be right back. And we're back with the Exterminator Reactive XT now. Uh, fully healed up. Fully ready to go. So without further ado, let me press myself up against this wall and start the timer. Wow, that was... um. Okay, buddy, settle down. I'm not even moving, and you're you're fucking missing. Uh, wow, we're gonna stay well above fifty percent with this armor. So it's looking like, see, we're learning things now. It's looking like the some of the best armor you can get is um, exterminator reactive and above. Because, well, I mean, I don't know about the Shinobu yet. We haven't gotten there because it's only, yeah, I think it's less damage absorption than this, but more durability. So it might even cause problems there, but. It's looking like, man, it's a huge step up from what we've been using uh, up to this here. So that is a stop. Um, 62%. Wow, that's wow, that's that's pretty impressive. That's pretty impressive uh, compared to these other armor, these other armors we've been trying. So obviously, I'm gonna write it down. Uh, let me heal up, and we'll be back with the next armor. All right, so now we're back with the Shinobu, and the Shinobu has 15% less damage absorption, but I'm pretty sure it has, yeah, it has 40 more durability, so we should have less overall health, I'm pretty sure, by the time this gets done. So, let's just go ahead and, uh, I'll even prop myself up against this fire hydrant, brother. All right, timer is start. Let's see what we, uh, let's see what we have here. Crazy, yeah. So it looks like we're gonna have probably roughly 50% health, uh, which is obviously going to be less than the reactive XT, but I think it's gonna be about the same as the regular reactive. Because um, yeah, we've we've lost about 25% health at that point. It might even be like 53% health. 
Uh, I'm not entirely sure. I really just wish he would stop missing, so I would I wouldn't have to keep uh, I wouldn't have to keep adjusting this timer. But you know, whatever. Because I'm only accounting for the actual hits. I don't want to account for the misses because that doesn't even count as a hit. That's not the time it takes to. Okay, that's a stop right there. I I know it still has one durability, but that is a stop right there because it says it's at zero percent. So. We're gonna call that. Should I call that a stop? I feel like it. No, we're gonna we're gonna let it hit that last one. I am gonna stop the timer. That's it. Boom. Done. Right there. That's a stop. Once that armor reaches zero durability, that is a stop. We have 78% health. Uh, so we actually did fall below the 50% uh, mark. Um, I'm gonna write. Obviously, I'm gonna write that all down. I'm gonna heal up, and uh, we will be right back. Okay, so. We are back uh, with the bioreactive uh, and full health. I am going to, I mean, I'm going to state that as a rule right now. Uh, if you have one durability left on the armor, that does not matter. It's until the armor is completely broken. I was going to stop it at 0%, but it still had a durability, so I felt like that wouldn't count. It has to be at zero durability in order for it to be completely gone. Obviously, unless we die uh, before uh, the armor breaks, like the fucking Xylon best. So we're going to wait for him and timer started. Um, it's looking like we are going to fare pretty well with this armor here. We might even stay above, like not just 50%, but above 50%, maybe well up there. I was just scratching my nipple. Uh, if you guys wanted to see that. Uh, are you gonna miss this time or? You know, because, like, if you're not, then I won't have to adjust the time. But if you are going to, because uh, you suck and we all know it, I'm going to have to adjust the time. Damn, might even stay above 55% uh, this time, which is pretty impressive. Okay, he did miss. He did miss. <laughs> Fucking loser. Can't even hit me. All right, so we are getting ready to make a stoppage. All right, that is a stop right there. 56%. Uh, wow, that is impressive. Bioreactive is showing up today. All right, you guys know the rule. I'm gonna heal up, I'm gonna write it down, and we'll be right back. All right, so I'm super impressed by the bioreactive. Uh, wound up with 56%. I think that's the highest we've had so far. Um, and we are back with the dusk reactive, completely healed up. Where did my doggy? Oh, you? oh, here's one. Oh, thank God. I thought you left me. I was like, what the fuck happened? Um, let's get you back down to this fire hydrant. Let's get ready to start this timer. Okay, he fucking missed. I'm going to go ahead and... I'm going to add two seconds onto the timer, but because he missed, I had to reset the timer. Like, he missed the first shot. Okay, and he just missed two. All right, brother. You need to calm that ass down. All right. Because you're, you're playing Wow, we, wow. Now this is an impressive little piece of armor here. We're gonna stay well above 75% when this armor is done. That's unbelievable. Shit, we might even stay above 80%. Dust Reactive obviously have a 90% damage absorption with 300 durability. Uh, okay, we're not gonna stay above 80%. Oh, that's not a stoppage. That is a stoppage right there. That's a stoppage. We're going to add two seconds onto the clock for that, obviously. Wow, 76%. That's, uh, that's, that's pretty fucking good, guys. That's pretty good. All right, you guys know the rules. We'll be right back. All right, so now is when we start getting into the really big boy arms. Okay, we got the da da go, da da go with, uh, hello? Hello, doggy. Oh, God. Stop running away from me like that, bro. You're scaring me. I actually don't think there's a difference between these two dogs here, but just in case there is, I'm going to kill that one, and I'm going to go with this one, because we've been going traditionally with this one. Um, We're getting into the big boy armors now, the that they go, and the vengeance guard. I have the thing reset. I'm just going to walk my silly little ass over here. Uh, probably just let him start chomping on me right about here. Okay, that's a start. Um really impressed with the dust reactive i mean even though obviously it doesn't have as much durability uh it kept us above 75 percent 
that's that's really good that's actually really good uh looking at 25 percent, we lost seven so seven times four is 28 so should be at about if things keep up we should be at about 72 percent um not as good as the dust reactive but more durability so i mean you know and obviously also a longer time alive as we are probably going to reach well over a minute um with this said enemy here um not a cow, man. I got a lot of durability, man. 390, and then we're about to double that durability and add an extra 5% damage absorption. So that's crazy. That's unbelievable. Uh, yeah, we, we have hit well over a minute for this here. Um, we are almost at a stoppage. That's not a stoppage. That is a stoppage right there. Okay. Uh, 68%. Wow, we took a lot of damage there at the end. Because it only had six durability, so we wound up just chunking that extra damage at the end. Um, but that's fine. That's fine. 68%. I can live with that. I can live with that. Literally, I can live with that. <laughs> I got 68% more to go before I fucking die. Alright, now we are on to the big daddy armor. The Vengeance Guard. Now, I know that a lot of you guys don't have the Vengeance Guard out there. So, eh, maybe it might be interesting for you guys to see... Uh, just how it fares up against some of these normal zombies and then just regular zombies around uh, Fort Pastor. Um, I'm sorry, second on Bunker, once we get to that point. Um, because, like, sometimes when you see it on the screen when I'm playing, it's like I'm getting hit by two things at once or things are happening really fast. Or you're paying more attention to what's going on on the screen than what my armor's at. So we are going to reset this timer. We're going to start it up here in a second. That's a start. Okay, uh, we'll see how well the uh, Vengeance Guard fares compared to everything else. It looks like because the Vengeance Guard has such a high durability, obviously, guys, and it is chunking a decent amount of that damage, that it is separating slightly. We have gone up to 7%, um, 9% now, but it looks like we might actually even wind up you fucking suck. Just hit me, brother. It looks like we might even wind up a little less than the Dusk Reactive, honestly, in terms of the health that we have left. Um, just because the, the fucking the durability is so high, y'all. Uh, and we are going... We're going to go well over... Um, I don't know if we'll go well over the, the expected seconds... Um, at almost a minute 45 um, but we are definitely going to go over it uh, we might even hit two minutes so these guys are definite outliers sorry definite outliers um, in terms of the the second ratio because the that the go was only supposed to last I think 58 seconds it wound up lasting 68 seconds so that was an extra 10 seconds right there and it's looking like I mean obviously there's a couple of misses here and there, but even even at a couple of misses here and there, we're about to hit the one minute forty second mark, and um, yeah, we still have over twenty percent to go. That's a minute forty right there, so and and still still twenty percent to go. Uh, it's just it's just a discrepancy because I I don't know if it's because of the, the durability is so high or what but i to figure out how long it was going or the estimated time it was supposed to take for all of these to break i did the same math i did the same math for every single one so they should have came out roughly the same but you know it's it's just how it is all right that's a stop that's a stop at two minutes and 10 seconds i'm gonna minus five seconds just because of potential misses i really wasn't paying attention to how many misses there were but if there was at least three misses which probably happened um that's about five seconds so let's go ahead and just write all that down um obviously i don't have to stop it now because this this is the end of the video right here so we're at 71 out of 160 for 44 percent so 71 out of 160 oops 160 for 44 percent um with it taking <laughs> 100 and uh, 105 seconds it was supposed to take 
that's a minute 45 we're at a minute 10 so that's um that is uh what was what, what, what's that was it two was that 130 seconds it's 130 seconds yeah okay yeah uh well i said i was gonna minus five for the thing so we'll say 125 so the discrepancy between the Tatakau reactive was 10 seconds and then the discrepancy for the vengeance guard was 20 seconds i don't know if that has any correlation maybe we'll find out in future videos um but i mean that's a that's an 80 percent accuracy rate fuck we'll say 75 percent accuracy rate even because man that's rough at 105 seconds are supposed to take and it wound up taking 125 i don't know why i did it like i try to keep these all the same so they're visually pleasing i don't know why i fucked that up uh, yeah, so for the dog zombie, this is all the stats here with the sports armors and the percentages and their durabilities, as well as the uh, expected armor survival time versus the actual armor survival time on the right. So this is expected and then this is the actual, uh, the accuracy based on my opinion. And this is the health that we have left after the... Um, after the armor broke obviously with the xylon vest it was zero out of 160 for zero percent because we fucking died uh or no sorry not that uh the flak jacket um was zero out of 160 for zero percent and obviously right at the bottom i put armor you die before it breaks this is the armor that you die with before it breaks uh i didn't even bother to do proper english because i had to put it in there so quick because I honestly was not expecting to die before any of these armors broke. Um, man, I should have repaired that armor to see if if I could do uh, sort of similar testing with it. Because that's that's actually that's actually very interesting. Um, so yeah, that's it. Obviously, we will continue to go down the list and make more of these as time goes on. Um, hopefully, it was interesting enough to you guys. I know that. Uh, I wasn't necessarily being too funny in this video. Um, I was just trying to be entertaining and informative as much as I could. Uh, and it's it's kind of a boring video. I'm not going to lie. But, you know, uh, shout out to anybody who made it this far. Um, shout out to anybody who's excited about the new series and excited about learning the information for the armors. I, I kind of want to bring back the exact bullet count videos, but I... I'll have to talk to somebody to see if I can if if I can do that. Obviously, on an alt account that I have no, I gain no experience from, I gain no money from, I don't loot anything. And we'll see, we'll see, uh, because I do think that it is important information, uh, just to to know that kind of stuff. But, oops, I just, oops, I'm fidgeting too much. But with all that being said. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy and you do look forward to the rest of the content I have to post, be sure to go down and hit the like button, subscribe button, and share button. Definitely leave a comment down below letting me know what you want to see next. And definitely be sure to go down and turn on post notifications so we can notify every time I upload a video because you're not going to miss what is next. Thank you guys so much for watching, especially those of you who made it all the way to the end.